Hello Capricorn, thank you so much for checking out this video. This is going to be a love reading for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. It's going to focus on the person that you're in a connection with or have some sort of connection with. Uh, we're going to look at their current energies, um, how they feel about you or think about you, what they would tell you if they had the chance, and kind of like your um, connection at this moment. Okay Capricorn, let's see. Spirit for Capricorn. <clears throat> what are the current energies for the person they are connecting with at this time? What is this person that Capricorn is doing with? What are the current energies? Huge thank you to everyone who has liked, commented, subscribed. I really appreciate it. Special thank you to those of you who actually take the time to write me such sweet comments. It does not go unnoticed. And it's, I, it's really been helping me a lot recently. So thank you. Okay, let's see. Ooh, door to romance. Love it. Okay, let's see. Someone wants to open the door to romance is what I'm seeing here. Dragon's Lair. Okay, this one kind of came out with it, but I only wanted one. One more for Capricorn, please. So Dragon's Lair is all about challenges ahead. Um, risks that have to be taken in order to, okay. Flying, I keep getting this one. Um, this is kind of being on cloud nine. So someone's possibly going to face some challenges regarding opening a door here to love, um, but it's gonna make them happy anyway, no matter what the challenges are. Because this is a 19, this is 20. So it's almost like they're gonna overcome the challenges to be happy. Here's another one about obstacles. Mountain at the bottom of the deck. This is someone trying to find a way out um, or around an obstacle. Let me look at flying real quickly here. Yeah, so you can see something from a higher perspective. Your waiting is over. All your hard work has paid off and the things you hope for are no longer beyond your scope. Interesting. So this person possibly felt like the door to romance would never open or they've been waiting a long time for this door to open and it's finally opened for them. It's brought challenges, there's risks, but it's not going to stop them from being happy. I feel like this is the way that your person is looking at your connection. They have to be brave. So how does this person see you or this connection, Capricorn? How does this person view Capricorn or this connection spirit? I can shuffle. How does this person view Capricorn or this connection spirit? How does this person view Capricorn or this connection spirit? Ooh, golden egg. This is all about a truth that needs to be spoken here. There's a truth hidden in that egg. What else? The Capricorn. How do they? Whale. Okay. So this person has a lot of, um, I think they, they view you as very wise, someone very deep. You have a lot of depth to you um, and they see that in you. They see you have a lot of experiences, um, a lot of wisdom. This person could also have deep emotions for you. Oh, MG, Panther. This is kind of like the tower card in the animal spirit deck where, you know, this panther um, kind of destroys what needs to be destroyed. So I feel like there's going to be a tower moment in this connection at some point. Um, however, it's going to bring success at the end of it. Um, there's going to be, it's almost like it was needed in order to see something from a higher perspective and have that success. Someone needs to communicate something here. So let's see, Capricorn, what would this person tell you if they could? If they had the chance to speak to you right now, what would they say? If this person had the chance to speak to you right now, what would they say? My little handmade oracle deck here. If they had to speak to you right now, what would they say? A transformation is taking place, okay. I feel like this person's going through changes. You are a light in my life. And I feel trapped. This 
person could be trapped in a situation right now. Bottom of the deck, I regret everything that happened. In interesting. This person has regrets. They recognize you as someone special in their life, but they feel trapped in a situation. So what's going on with your connection right now? What are the mutual energy spirit? What's going on here between Capricorn and this person you're connecting with? What's going on to this person? What's going on for this person? What are the mutual energy spirit between Capricorn? And this person they're connecting with nine of pentacles interesting someone's feeling secure right now stable um oh eight of cups reverse someone definitely wants to return here they could view you as someone stable and secure capricorn they could view you as someone independent someone's watching you page of swords Knight of Pentacles reversed. Okay, so this is someone who's been very delayed. There's something um, slowing this person down. Could be that they're trapped in a situation right now. But they're watching you. They're thinking about returning. Ten of Wands reversed. So someone here was possibly forced to let a burden go um, because it was too overwhelming. Bottom of the deck, the higher font, sign of Taurus here. So let's clarify these and see what more messages we can get. For Capricorn, please, Spirit. Help me clarify these messages, please. For Capricorn. Okay. Let's clarify these. This is driving me nuts. What are my crystals? <laughs> Tell me about this Nine of Pentacles. Someone that could be single here. Again, very secure or confident, um, stable. King of Wands, Queen of Pentacles. So someone here wants to make a move on someone that they feel is very stable and secure. It could be um, another earth sign that you're dealing with, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or it could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Doesn't have to be those signs. This is just someone here who has a lot of passion and attraction for someone that's stable, secure, who's a good partner. Tell me more about this Nine of Pentacles, please. Nine of Wands. Someone here is tired. Someone here has been through a lot. Um, but they've survived. They haven't let, they haven't let this, this, they're not giving up. This could be you or the person you're connecting with. Feel free to flip the roles if they resonate more. Tell me about this Eight of Cups reverse. Tell me about this Eight of Cups. Ooh, the lover's reverse. Someone made the wrong choice here. Wants to return. The lover's reverse is, it could be a breakup, but it could also be that someone chose to follow their head rather than their heart or vice versa. They made a wrong choice in love. Tell me more. So this person has gotten new clarity here. Um, and they have a decision to make. Based on what they know, they're seeing something from in a new perspective, a past relationship or a decision they made in the past. They're seeing that in a new perspective here. Tell me about the page of swords. I feel this person's watching you. I feel like this page of swords is looking at this nine of pentacles. This is also someone that could be wanting to communicate some sort of truth or information here. Why is this page of swords here, spirit? Nine of cups. So they see you as their wish fulfillment. Or vice versa. Queen of cups, yeah. 
This person has a lot of emotion for you, a lot of love for you, Capricorn. Anything else? Wow. Knight of Wands reversed, the tower reversed, and the moon upright. Someone's trying to avoid a tower moment. Someone was not ready to commit at some point in time, or there's some sort of player energy here, someone in and out of your life, um, possibly because they wanted to avoid a tower moment. I feel like that tower moment is still happening or will happen. Um, the moon here tells me that someone, I was not seeing something clearly. Something was an illusion and someone's finally seeing it for what it truly was. Um, there could be a lot of doubt and fear here as well. Doubt of the unknown or fear of the unknown. Possibly they don't know how this conversation will play out and it scares them. Um, or, you know, they're still trapped in a situation here trying to avoid this tower moment. Tell me about this Knight of Pentacles reverse. This could be someone who's financially um, insecure right now or, or unstable right now as well. Tell me more about this Knight of Pentacles reverse. And because of that, they're delayed. Ooh, Queen of Swords reverse. This is someone very cold, mean. This is someone who's extremely protective over their heart. Ten of Swords reversed. So this is someone who's overcome some sort of difficult ending. Possibly a difficult ending with a Queen of Swords energy. Someone that was, um, you know, they use words to hurt. They can be very hurtful um, in their communication. The Star reversed. Someone here um, is trying to keep the faith. And Ace of Swords, again, that clarity. Someone's had new clarity to, to, to begin something new here, but they're delayed. Yeah, Six of Wands reverse. Something that was not a success for this person. And they're realizing now that it wasn't it wasn't meant to work out or they made the wrong choice here. Um They want to return with the Eight of Cups or reverse, or they can't leave a situation too. But more I'm thinking that they, they want to return. Tell me about this Ten of Wands reverse. Wow. Ten of Cups and Six of Cups, and then I got the Temperance card. Yeah, someone here wants to drop a burden or has dropped a burden regarding wow this is someone that is still thinking about the past this is someone that has fond memories of the past things that this person is um someone that fulfills them emotionally there's a lot of love here and then we got temperance sign of sagittarius here this is someone that wants to come together with someone wants to blend something successfully that once has patience and balance I feel like this person wants to balance out a situation. Seven of Pentacles. They want to invest in this person from the past is what I'm getting. Now this could be you Capricorn or this could be the person you are dealing with. Someone wants to return. They made a wrong choice about love. They've gotten clarity about that. And this King of Wands wants to make an offer here. Someone's trying to keep the faith even though they feel stuck possibly. And they've overcome some sort of difficult ending. They're healing from that slowly. Um, it's, it's a slow healing with the star reversed. You know, it's like this person has, still has difficult, a difficult time. But they're getting clarity on, on a situation and it's helping them heal. And this person, I'm telling you, this person has a lot of love for someone here. Um, they, they, they see someone as their wish fulfillment here. And this could be you. Could be a water sign that you're dealing with as well. But someone here sees someone um, as their wish fulfillment. And, um, and even though there's a lot that's unknown with the moon, there's possibly some secrets or things that haven't been said or haven't been 
revealed here. Um, you know, this person, I feel like they were trying to avoid a tower moment in the past, possibly, and it just, it didn't work out. And they lost a lot because of that. And, and the transformation is taking place because this person is having realizations about their true wish fulfillment, about their true happiness. I don't think they're getting it where they are if they feel trapped here. And this person, I, I feel like this person is the one that wants to open this door to romance. And they want to balance something out. And you could be dealing here with a few signs. I see Sagittarius, Aquarius, Pisces, Scorpio, Pisces, Gemini. You could be dealing with an earth sign, a fire sign, an air sign, or, um, or a water sign. All the signs are here. But specifically, the major arcanas are the ones that I I, I um, talked about. And, you know, this panther and this I feel trapped, I feel like that's this tower moment that someone was trying to avoid. Someone was trying to avoid a tower moment and they trapped themselves is what I'm thinking, what I'm seeing here. Otherwise, I'll leave it here at Capricorn. I hope that this reading resonated with some of you. If it did, please let me know. I love to hear from you. Um, huge thank you to everyone who has liked, shared, and subscribed. I really appreciate it. If this did not resonate with you, it's okay. It just wasn't your reading this time around. And you can check your other placements for more messages. Sometimes those can resonate more. All right, Capricorn, I'll leave it there. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in another video. Take care.